welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a like self-care Sunday kind of vibe. It doesn't always end up on Sundays, but for some reason this week it just does. But yeah, I'm home alone tonight. Everyone's working, everyone's out of the house. So I get a very much me night that's kind of needed. So it's going to be like the full shower, shave the legs, wash the hair kind of night, which I mean, if you know, you know, everyone loves it. Also, part of my self-care is having a clean space. So, like the clips here, I vacuum the floor and then mop. Because when my space isn't clean, and it's like cluttered, I'm, I'm cluttered. I feel cluttered, anxious, so I just need to get all that out of the way before I can truly relax. <laughs> There's nothing more relaxing than lighting a candle when it's, oops, when it's starting to get dark out. Like on a Sunday night. Ultimate cozy vibes. This one is the Sand and Fog Asian Pear. Smells delightful. Something I can't forget to do is water my plants. Because I, I either do it Saturday or Sunday, and clearly I didn't do it yesterday. So I can't forget to do it today. So I don't want these little guys to die. Oh. I just have my laptop here. I think I'm gonna pull up a YouTube video and then get some leftovers. I have some leftovers from last night, so that's perfect for tonight because I don't have to cook anything. Just heat it up and we're good to go. So a great way to start the relaxing and like chill night. I have some leftover stuffed pork, Brussels sprouts with bacon, and like little small baby potatoes. Sorry for the awful lighting. I'm going for all the cozy vibes right now. Oh, this looks amazing. I just warmed it up and let's see. Mm. Did you see how soft that was? Amazing. I'm so excited for this cookie. So since I'm washing my hair, I'm gonna be putting, I'm gonna put a bit of coconut oil in there. That's nice and greasy. Loves it. Like I mentioned in my last video, I take off my makeup with the Pond's cold cream. I just take some on my fingers and then rub that into my face. And like I said, really enjoy this stuff. It takes off waterproof makeup. You know, there's no complaints here. It does leave a bit of a film on your face, so I do suggest rinsing or washing your face after, but definitely more gentle than using a makeup wipe or anything of the sort. Let me just finish doing this and I'll be back. So let me grab some water. I always like to bring a water bottle into the hot tub, so let's fill that up. Perfect. 
let's go. The worst part about going in the hot tub is getting out of the hot tub. And now it's shower time. I just put a leave-in conditioner. Sometimes I like to add in oh, a detangling spray. It's a green tea mask, calming and smoothing. Well, not soothing, smoothing. There we go. Let's go make tea. for probably 15 minutes oh that feels nice and then I'm gonna be taking a drop of the hyaluronic acid and some of the niacinamide and zinc both by the ordinary I do a little bit of each mix it together and then put that on my face And then my last step, I do this about once a week. Well, this is my daily moisturizer, the CeraVe Moisturizing Lotion. But I take about two drops of a face tanner, just self tanning drops from Isle of Paradise in medium. And I just do a fair bit of my moisturizer and then I do two drops, mix that in nicely and then make sure I get it evenly across my face because I've made the mistake of not having it even and my face was blotchy. So to make sure to get this everywhere, it's just a very natural looking tan if you just do a couple drops. All I'm looking for. And that just about concludes today's video. Like I said, I'm in a reading phase which is really good because I've been on my phone a lot less so we'll see how long that lasts but that's it for my self-care sunday i'm all relaxed and ready for the week also don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one bye